Oh no! How embarrassing! You don't want to be like this guy. Introducing RPM Tesla's Gen 2 Cubby for your Tesla. It's built of one solid ABS. It also comes with an aluminum handle. It also comes with velvet lining and slot locking and many front panel options to choose from. Best of all, it's made in the USA strong. So don't be like this guy, be like this guy, looking really cool with his RPM Tesla's Gen 2 Cubby for his Tesla Model S and Model X. Ludicrous away, operators are standing by. Hey guys, how's it going? And another episode of Let's Talk Tesla. And I've been looking for a cubby drawer for my Tesla Model S. And recently, RPM Tesla just released one. Dashboard drawer for 59 bucks, man. It's Gen 2. It was so awesome. So I decided, I'm like, you know what? I need to get one of these, man. Because it's got the new fully lined velvet interior. I mean, when you go to our website, you'll see what the whole thing's all about. I mean, it's made in the USA and there's a lot of bunch of different uh, front style to match your car. Dude, I was sold, man. So I went ahead and ordered mine. Pretty easy. Just go to their website, click on the style that you want. So if you want like the carbon fiber, that's what I would click. And then there it is, carbon fiber wrap front. And then you choose the lining that you got inside or in the color of the T that you want on there. Go ahead and put in your basket and check out. And that is pretty much it, man. Next thing you know, you're done. All right, guys. So our package is here. We got our, um, our Tesla Model S Cubby. Let's check it out. The tray's out there. Uh, in Tesla world. But I know the others are like ones made from cardboard. And, uh, and I think I saw another one from Evanex that had like a, it's like a plastic and it's kind of flimsy. So let's look at um, let's look at RPM Teslas. So first of all, you have these uh, for your installation. They look like uh, they look like Hershey's, <laughs> but we'll do that on our install video. So as you can see, there's a carbon fiber um, logo right inside there, as you can see, and this is a uh, Alcantara suede, and I have the carbon fiber interior and this right here will match it perfectly and you have like a nice solid aluminum here and and this is this is going to match the frame around our display screen so solid it's built solid man I don't see it going to be warping or anything like that. It looks pretty solid, so I think I think RPM Tesla hit it out of the park on this one. So, um, and the install, from what I've seen from Mark's video, it's going to be really easy. So this is really going to come in handy for putting my phone and uh, change and other things in that little cubby area. So, because I've been putting a lot of my stuff inside the uh, inside the, the the center the center console, you know, but it's hard to dig for things there. And of course, when I put my stuff on um, right on the shelf at the bottom of the display, every time you know, uh, if I have to accelerate quickly, pretty much all the contents in there will fly away. And uh, I'm really excited. I'm really excited for this product, and this, this is such an awesome, awesome product, guys. It's like really solid, sturdy ABS plastic. 
and you can't beat it. All right, guys. So now we're gonna go ahead and install our Tesla cubby from RPM Tesla, and I'm sure this is gonna be one of the toughest install that we're gonna have to do. So the box that came with RPM Tesla, carbon fiber. As you guys can see, uh, I have the carbon fiber decor on the car. So let's go ahead and get this bad boy out. And again, sturdy, sturdy ABS plastic with Alcantara liner in there. Wow, it's a great, great product. Solid and sturdy. Look at that. Okay. It's got the Tesla logo in there, and you have the bumpers that you're gonna need to stop the drawer from opening. And again, what did I tell you guys about RPM Tesla, right? Nothing but the best. 3M tape is what they use. This 3M works. Alright, so let's go ahead and install this bad boy. So what you're gonna do is as you can see, it slides right in there, man, it snaps in. I mean, literally, you don't even have to put the bumpers on there because it's done, right? Well, that's awesome. That's some great engineering. Look at that. So the only issue is it comes out like that, you know, because nothing holds it in. So what you're gonna do is, you're gonna go ahead and use these tapes these bumpers to stop it from coming out. So, what you're gonna do is take the tape out and then you're gonna mount it where you want it to stop. So, for me, I probably want mine to stop right here and put it in the very edge. Okay, hold on. Let's see. See where I put it right there? Okay, get a nice firm push. Turn the heat on the car. <laughs> Alright, so that's mounted nice in there. And so we want to make it even. I think that looks pretty good right there. And I'm going to take the other piece out. Take it to the very edge. Do it right the first time, so you, you do not have to do it again. So give me like a few seconds or so to kind of push down on it to make sure that it's there solid. All right. Okay. Man, I think we did it. So you can see the bumpers right there, right? Bumper on each side, can you see it? Okay, so you're like, oh my God. Now it's stuck, how do I get it out? Well, just like some of the drawers you have at home, you lift up the drawer and pop, it comes out. And then you got your drawer back. As you can see the bumpers right there, that's our stoppers. So, again, put it back in, have it tilted, get under those bumpers, and you're in. And it doesn't fly out, you see? Now I can put all my stuff in there. And not worry about a thing and it snaps in right there and look at that perfect matching with the trim from my screen to the drawer handle wow awesome guys you gotta get yours uh, if you have a if you have a Tesla you gotta get one I mean and they come in different colors as well and different uh, designs uh, decor to match your decor so uh, I got the carbon fiber one, so and and there's a great uh, promotion right now at RPM Tesla to get yours, and you need to get one. So now let's see how much it can hold. So before I had this in there, open this. As you can see how sturdy it is, it's gonna be locked in place. Let's get see. This is where I was keeping all my stuff. Right? What a pain in the butt! Like, cause if I have to put like a a, a, a drink in here. Well, I gotta remove this, I gotta remove this, I gotta remove this. It's just a total pain. I mean, look at that. I got all these junk in here. That's probably what you're gonna say. 
dude, you have too much junk in there. Yeah, you're, I bet you're right. So, now, in, in this case, you know, I like to keep a rag in here because uh, our screen does get dirty a lot. So, I mean, like, I have a USB cable in there for a micro USB. Oh, there's a salt rag in there. But now, I can just put those things in here. And things won't fly out. That's right. Secure in there. I got my drink uh, containers holders back, right? And if it's cool because look at the OEM, right? You feel it. It's like a, a Alcantara, like a velvet lining, and we open RPM Tesla. I mean, it's the same. It's the same, guys. It's awesome. Look at that. Fantastic, man. All right, guys. So we just installed. The RPM Tesla drawer right here, as you can see, it stays in place. Okay, I'll punch it here. Not going anywhere. Not going anywhere. Awesome, right? And I can close it up again. And we'll punch it again. Not going anywhere. Kudos to RPM Tesla guys, and I just want to thank you guys for watching our video. And don't forget, I have the links below for RPM Tesla, so you can order yours. And if you have a Tesla, man, you need to get one, you know. So it's it's. Don't forget to share, like our video. I will talk to you guys in our next video. All right, guys, later.